tasty. Teresa Judice goes from screaming prostitution whore to being called a production bore. What's up guys, I'm John Bastow, and this is Buzz 60. Yeah, that table flip heard round the world made Teresa Judice a breakout star on Real Housewives of New Jersey. Being indicted on 41 counts of bank, bankruptcy, and mail fraud, however, can mellow a matriarch. And facing a potential prison sentence after pleading guilty to tax evasion and fraud charges could make someone forego the fighting. And that's just what has RHONJ producers so annoyed right now. According to Radar Online, they're reportedly furious the best-selling author and Fabellini creator didn't bring it in season six. By it, they mean the drama. Despite getting a massive paycheck to return to the reality show, a Radar source says the mother of four made filming difficult by refusing to engage with the cast, even when they called her out on the legal mess. Not me! That's right, Teresa, though the producers may think the drama-free footage you delivered may not be good for ratings, sometimes playing it safe is the recipe of choice when it comes to real life. Buzz 60, now you know, pass it on. Hi, we're the Real Housewives of New Jersey, and you're watching New Media Stew with JB. Power in Times Square, here you go. Ooh, there's this beauty, and then, uh-oh, poster with a booyah point. We're in the wild in Times Square. And the fabulous John Bates down here's Culture Pop is uh, gracing us on the ad here. My favorite thing that she said is, uh, <laughs> oh my god, I've never seen one of these posters in the wild before. So guys, Stu Crew, if you happen to see this right here, please take a picture of yourself with the poster, send it in to my Twitter, and we will get you on the show. And that is twitter.com slash John at John Bastow. Booyah! 